hello fox today we will learn about how to create ui table view shift 3 so please open xcode create a new project single view application name it ui table view demo we will choose language as swift and press next we will select the location and that's it our project is here just automatically open your view controller here first we will declare iv out let for i ui table view tvl demo ui table view So we will miss week and then UI table view. Okay, go to your main storyboard, search for UI table view, drag it to our view controller. We will give it auto layout of 0, 0, 0 from bottom 0 and here it is. So it's asking us to change the frame as per our constraints. Now here it's done. Now first we don't want our table view to show the rows if it's empty like i will show you it succeeded Yeah, now you can see the separators are shown. So we don't want these separators when our table view is empty. So we can write the line tbl demo dot table filter view is equals to ui view dot init with frame. We will the frame zero. Now you will see those separators are gone as a UI table view is empty. Oh, there is fatal error because we didn't connect our UI table view outlet to our table. Now, so this errors occur because we don't connect our UI table view or UI outlet with our UI table view in the storyboard. Okay now. Now you are seeing empty. No table separators are there. Now let's start. So for this we have our data source. As you know that every table requires data source and delegate so that it can display data 
on UI table and, and handle the selection. So this error shows that we didn't tell this view controller that it will implement UI table view delegate and UI table view data source. Now we tell that this will implement now we have to implement those here you can see the UI table view methods we will implement number of rows in the section and cell for row at index path okay Data source, it's time to implement those. The first method that is table view number of rows in section tells our table view that how many rows it contains within one section. By default, every table view has one section. We will return five rows. Now, the second method you can see here it is the main method that it defines how the cell data should be shown or which data is shown by the cell so let's jump let's cell equals to table view dot dq to use cell with identifier identifier now we have to check whether if our cell is nil if cell equals to nil then we have to alloc init equals to ui table view cells dot init with cell style we will default and we will give it an identifier as we given above okay now we will give cell dot text label to text equals to test so, and we will return our newly created cell here now here you can see that cannot assign to value cell okay we have to tell that this is UI table view cell and also we created it let that is constant but we are modifying ourselves that's why it's giving error that you can't modify let so we have to change it to where let's see if our table works or not we're launching the app now you can see the five rows okay if we change it to eight and then run it this eight rows of the learn how to integrate UI table view in Swift 3 with the default cell provided. If we want to use our delegate to select which row is tabbed, we can use did select row there it is did select for row at index path it tells which row is selected by the user. Now, Point row selected. Now here, if we then tap row, you can see 
below that row selected row selected row selected so that's it for today in this video you learn how to implement the basic ui table view using the ui table view cell stay tuned for more tutorials thank you